Hi guys. Here we have predictions for three of today's playoff games. Let's get started. Los Angeles Lakers and Memphis Grizzlies. The Lakers and Grizzlies square battle in Game 2 of the West Conference first round playoffs at the FedEx Forum in Memphis. The Lakers played well on the road this season, winning and covering in 21 of their 42 games. In recent road games, the Lakers played great, winning in 5 and covering the spread in 4 of their last 6 road games. The Grizzlies are the league's most dominating home teams. This season, they have won 35 of their 42 home games while covering only 23. Recently, the Grizzlies have won 7 of their previous 9 home games but covered a spread only 3 times. Head to head, the Lakers covered only 3 times in the last 9 games, which they have played against the Grizzlies in Memphis. The Grizzlies enter this match without Brandon Clark and Steven Adams, and possibly without John ja Morant, while the Lakers are fully healthy. This is the 5th game between those 2 teams this season. The Lakers won 3 of those 4. The first matchup between these two teams saw the Lakers in their very best performance since the start of the season. If you were skeptical about what this Lakers squad could achieve, like I was, their performance proved we are all wrong. The Lakers appear to be championship contenders. Morant may not be available for today's game, but the Grizzlies can play without him, and I believe they can even win. The Lakers got what they wanted, and it seems they will not be as motivated in this game as they were in the first. Their performance in the first game persuaded me that they could go far in the championship this season, but I will give the advantage to the Grizzlies in this game to win and tie the series. Play Memphis Grizzlies plus 1. Miami Heat and Milwaukee Bucks. The Heat and Bucks square battle in the second game of the East Conference first round playoffs at Milwaukee's Fiserv Forum. This season the Heat haven't been playing their best in road games. They only won 18 of their 42 road games although they did cover 17 of those 42. Recently three of their previous six road games ended in victories, while only two games covered the spread. Since the beginning of the season, the Bucks have been playing excellent ball on their court. They won 32 of their 42 home games. Recently, they've won and covered the spread in four of their previous eight home games. Head to head, the Heat covered twice in the last six games, which they have played against the Bucks in Milwaukee. Tyler Harrow is out for the hit, and Kyle Lowry is questionable. The Bucks are in severe trouble since they won't have Johnny Zantutacumbo or Wesley Matthews. This is the sixth meeting between these two teams this season. Three of these five were won by the hit, including the first game of this series. Everyone in Milwaukee is probably angry about what happened to Johnny's, but as I've already mentioned, the Bucks are by far the better squad here and will win both this game and this series even without him. Play Milwaukee Bucks plus 6. Minnesota Timberwolves and Denver Nuggets. At the Ball Arena in Denver, Game 2 of the West Conference first round playoffs pits the Timberwolves against the Nuggets. The Timberwolves were playing pretty well on the road this season. They won 20 of their 42 road games while covering 22 of those 42. The Timberwolves have recently played great ball on the road. They won 5 of their previous 7 road games while covering the spread in 6. The Nuggets are one of the league's most dominant teams on their home court. Since the start of the season, they have won 34 of their 41 home games. Four of the Nuggets' previous five home games had ended in wins, with three of those five covering the spread. Head-to-head, -head, the Timberwolves covered seven of the last eight games against the Nuggets in Denver. Jaden McDaniels and Nat Reed have been ruled out, while Rudy Gober and Jalen Noel are questionable. Nikola Jokic was listed as uncertain by the Nuggets. This was the fifth meeting between these two teams this season, and the Nuggets won three of them, including the most recent, the first in this series. The Nuggets won handily in the first game, which surprised me, and what was even more surprising was that they played the best defense since the start of the season in that game against the Timberwolves. I believe the Nuggets will win this series, but it will not be as simple as it was in the first game, especially given the Joker is not the healthiest for the playoffs. I'm sure if there wasn't some serious problem with him, he wouldn't be on the list of injured Nuggets players. Maybe Joker may play tonight, but I believe he has a more serious health condition than we realize. Joker has been on the injury list extremely rarely in his career, especially in games of this significance, so if you want to bet on the Nuggets, consider this with caution. I will take the Timberwolves to cover the spread. Play Minnesota Timberwolves plus 9. Guys, that's all. Thank you for joining us today. See you tomorrow.